Two eight five one, turn right heading one eight zero. Hey everyone, welcome back to DJ's Aviation, another update regarding the Boeing NMA, dubbed to be the 797. As the 2019 Paris Air Show that takes place in June rapidly approaches, expect a whole lot more aircraft news and more. For stories I can't cover here on the channel, the best place to go is over to my Twitter or Instagram, which will be linked in the description below. With that being said, following news that Boeing's NMA will see a delayed announcement, which will now likely take place in 2020, thanks to industry experts have learned a whole lot more about the cockpit that could actually feature inside the aircraft. The plans to reveal the Boeing NMA have not just been put on hold because of research, but also due to various problems involving their 737 MAX. However, the idea of a one-man cockpit is incredibly exciting and intriguing for me at the very least. According to industry analysts at Jefferies, who took the time to interview high-ranking board members at a range of airlines in regards to the Boeing NMA, it was indeed revealed that these airlines wanted the Boeing NMA to be a new aircraft, and the overall agreement between carriers was new tech on the aircraft and new designs that will further revolutionise the aircraft side of things would be beneficial. The biggest development, though, was the universal agreement that the airline executives believed that the Boeing NMA would be able to seat just one pilot physically and fly safely rather than the current amount. While there'd be one pilot physically sat in the cockpit, airline executives believe that a second pilot would actually be on the ground, not in the NMA. From this position on the ground, the pilot would be monitoring not only just one aircraft, but several at a time, kind of like an air traffic controller. The second pilot would likely be monitoring things that the pilot would not be able to do. There are many benefits to doing this for some airlines, however there are also quite a few negatives. One benefit though is that carriers would not have to fork out as much to pay its pilots, and this is a real issue currently. While on the surface, this does seem like a potential good idea. In a statement sent directly to CNBC, Boeing confirmed that their NMA won't feature such technology. They said, We remain focused on executing on our commitments, including evaluating the business case for the NMA. With that said, should we launch, the NMA flight deck is being designed for two pilots, and we've been consistent that we don't see NMA as a technology push airplane. Obviously, a major problem with the original proposal is the safety of the passengers on board and their peace of mind. Multiple aircraft manufacturers believe that while this particular technology should not be ruled out for future use, it's simply not ready to be installed on aircraft as of right now. The best proof can be found from that statement by Boeing. With that being said, what are your thoughts on this proposal where you could have one person in the cockpit rather than two? The second pilot would be located on the ground. Remember that this is coming from industry experts who actually interviewed airlines, so it's something we could definitely see in the future. With that being said, thank you very much for watching another one of my videos, and I do very much look forward to you all joining me in the next one. Oh, well.